So it's 6 p.m. on Friday, which means it's time for Ice versus Fire Team 2. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable Ultimate Team coins, check out MMOEXP.com. Link in the description. Save 5% using code HABER. For Neymar and Son, this team actually looks like it could potentially be better. We have got Rodri, who looks a little bit juiced. And by a little bit, I mean quite juiced. Uh, we've got Rashford, who's looking pretty spicy. Renard, who looks meh. Rudiger looks very, very good. Homan looks solid. Sanchez looks very good. Joao Felix looks very good. Tamori is looking pretty nice in terms of the ice and the fire version. We've got Cody Gakpo and Rich Hollis as well. I'd argue that team as a whole, maybe the top end isn't as good as Neymar and Son, but as a whole, that team's looking a bit better in my opinion. I've got 385 plus picks to open. Let's see what we get. I just want Rashford EA. All I want is any version of Rashford, please. Both versions look really good. Either get in my team, please. Give me a Rashford in a pack today. That's all I ask for. Not looking good. We've had Modric, Beth Mead, and Angola Kanze so far. I've got 384 times five to open as well. So we'll see if we get something good. There's also store packs as well. I think there's a tradable store pack this week too. Hang on. Oh, do you know what I thought for a second? You know when you've got a double walkout and the other walkout's gold? But one of them's an ice or fire card. It will show them as a gold walkout. That's good. That two informs is very good. Kengis with a really nice game as well. You guys saw that he scored two or three absolute bangers. I think he scored four goals in the game too. Um, yeah, I thought for a second that was when like you get a double walkout and the first one shows up as gold. And I thought it might have been Rashford's ice card. That's a striker. We do get ourselves a Bernardo Silva though, which is nice. 88 rated. Good fodder. Who may only get discarded. I don't know if I've got him in the club or not. I do have him in the club. That's painful. Okay, well, I will probably not recover him, but I thought that counts. All right, third and final one. We also have Icon Player Fix today as well, which we'll be opening. Spanish, center mid from Barcelona. It is going to be Pedri. Pedri, but a double walkout. Pedri and Pop. Do we have an ice or fire card dangling behind that as well? No, we do not. Not the Dutch center four we were looking for. Okay, fair enough. Now let's go and open up the store pack and see what we get in the old store pack or store packs, should I say. I'm going to do the tradable one first. It is 100 rare gold players, two guaranteed 86 or higher, no rating minimum for the 100 players, 13% chance of either ice or fire player, and a 50% chance of a team of the week. 350k it is tradable. That is interesting. It is no ice or fire card in here because if there was, it would show up at the front as it is a tradable pack. But we get ourselves Rodri and Harry Kane. Good fodder. The fodder's all right there. I'll take the fodder. What else we got in there? Team of the Weeks, maybe? All right. Two informs, which is nice. That's good. I think, to be honest, I'm going to send them to the transfer list and sell them. Um, and then they should not be at the back of the pack because it's a tradable pack. So, theoretically, yeah, I was going to say, they should not be there. We do get ourselves Rodri, Diaz. In terms of actually, like, maybe the value of this pack, that wasn't worth it at all. That really wasn't. But... You know, it's tradable. So I guess if you've been saving your FC points to open up an ice or fire pack, I don't know why you would. Probably go for the tradable one. It's better for the coins, better for the for your economy of your account. But it probably will suck. Anyway, we have a versus foundation pack. 58 one or higher, two guaranteed 86 or higher. Let's open this up for a thousand FC points and see what we get. Norway, Cam, Erdogan. I'm going to skip it. No one cares to watch Erdogan walk out. Got so Salah in there as well. Good fodder. Bardacki, Adel Karim Bardacki. I don't think there's an ice or fire card in here. Yeah, there's not because their player pick was too close to the front. Well, they kind of suck, didn't they? Hopefully, my open player pick's better than that. Right, now it's time for my 87 plus base Centurions or Thunderstruck icon player picks. Now, I submitted a bunch of base icons into this that I haven't been using that I've been building up from the last few packs. So we might get a few less dupes in this one. Here we go. Come on, EA. A big pull, please. Let's see who we get. Yes. Let's go. Yes. Wow. That's awesome. Um, hooray. <laughs> Yippee. Yes. What a, what a dubski. Wow. Ian Wright. Wow. I'm so excited about that. Yes. Hooray! All right, now it's time for Lala's icon player pick. Hopefully, he's better than mine because that was a horrendous start. That was absolutely terrible. All right, here we go. Ooh, hoo, hoo. That is exciting. That's an exciting card, man. 
Thunderstruck Kaka. So he's worth about a million coins, right? But also, that's an exciting card. I think whenever Kaka gets a juiced card or like a special version, he just always seems so good. So, of course, we're going to take Kaka. That's a nice card, man. That is a dub. We take that. In the second player pick as well, that's always nice. I feel like last week, we only saw base icons that were decent. So, to get a decent special version is a nice start. All right. We have got my boy Nick's player pick next. He's on Xbox. So, we're watching it through Xbox. Oh, Vandasar is class. Vandasar is very good. EA are paying out with the Thunderstruck icons today. Well, it's early days, but you know. That is class, man. That is really, really good. I have no idea what this card is worth. But this card is worth half a million coins. Not quite Kaka. I know my, my reaction probably seemed a bit more excited for that than Kaka. But the only reason why is because in previous years, Vandasar special cards have been top, top, top tier. So it's just psychologically in my brain, I've always thought he's a mad card. But that's really good still. All right, now it's time for my boy Cridian's player pick. Let's see. Maybe today we're just getting good luck. I mean, obviously mine stunk. But maybe I had to sacrifice my bad pick for everyone else's good picks. Third one or fourth one? I don't really know. Ru oh my god, Eusebio's in there. That's, mate, I've honestly, I got so tunnel visioned on Rooney, who's class, by the way. Didn't even notice Eusebio. Rooney's worth half a mil. You know, that's always fun. You have the Centurion. I thought you might have had the Centurion. Eusebio is worth about. Let me see how much the base is worth. 1.4 million. It's going to be a Rooney pick because the. He already has Centurion Eusebio, unless he wants the fodder. Rooney's a good card. But, like, if he didn't have the Centurion, what a player pick that would have been. All right, now it's time for John's player pick. These seem cracked today, man. These seem absolutely insane. Storage comp's not bad. If that's going to be what a bad player pick... I mean, mine was, was terrible. If that's going to be a bad player pick today, we're in for a good one. The storage comp's solid. I think he had an SBC for a better version, so if he didn't do that, then you're happy. But yeah, we'll take that. All right, now it's time for Dan the Gooner's icon player pick. Here we go. What we got in this one? He's a, he is an Arsenal fan. Pires ain't bad for an Arsenal fan. Ah, uh, that's a bit suspect. But like, hey, you know, as an Arsenal fan, you're probably really happy with that, right? Really, really happy. Really, really happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, next. Icon player pick. It has just gone 615, so the rotation might have changed. The pre-615 rotation was crazy. Maybe it's changed. We'll have to see. Who knows? Next icon player pick, though. Another Vanessar. Rotation might not have changed. We'll take another Vanessar. Half a million coins right there. That is always nice to see. Always nice to see. All right, I think we found the red list right here. I think we may have found the red list. He's got a pack pulled of basically every good icon, like Thunderstruck Neymar, Every good hero. Like, it's crazy. Well, not every good icon. There's still some good icons you can get. And uh, he probably will. He probably will. Let's see who he gets in his icon player pick. Come on, EA. Something good. That's interesting. Thunderstruck Luis Figo. That's a really interesting card, actually. Again, another card I haven't seen a lot of at all. Which is why I'm quite intrigued by it. He's worth nearly half a million coins. Four star, four star. The card looks all right, to be fair. His balance needs a bit of an increase. But, like... He still do a job, in my opinion. My boy Robert's icon player pick. He has Bobby Charlton pack pulled on the bench. Excuse me? Ooh, Carlos Alberto is class, man. That is very good. And the reason why it's very good as well, he plays a three centre-back formation. And that is like the perfect wide CB on this game. Worth about 700k. Just overall, an absolute dub, in my opinion. We take that. It is Dario's icon player pick next. Come on, EA. Someone good, please. Yes! That's a huge W. Eric Cantona. Dario is a big United fan. Big Cantona fan as well. That is a big W. Eric Cantona. I imagine... I've not used him this year, actually. But I imagine he's probably very good in game. It's a shame it's not the Thunderstruck version. He's worth about a million. But this card's still worth half a million. Five-star skills, four-star weak for overall. It's a really good card. I feel like he's a bit under the radar. Like, that's a sick card. And people just don't use it that much. All right, Anthony's icon pick next uh it, it, it's sort of an overall right i feel like these picks have been way better this week than in previous weeks did i speak too soon that's not great i mean zanetti's okay 
Zola's average. Vidic is average. I think all three are pretty average. It's okay. It's just not insane. We've got Julian's icon player pick next. Come on, EA. Let's get him R9. He wants R9. Not a big ask, is it? Ooh, Butra Gwedo. He actually said he was going to get more as well. The funny thing is he literally says he's about to get more. But Butra Gwedo is a good one, man. Butra Gwedo is a very good one. I don't know. Like, I feel like he's still worth a lot. His special version, unfortunately, uh, is a winter wildcard icon, not like a Thunderstruck. And that one has four-star skills, which is worth... That special version's worth a little bit more. But, like, nearly 600k. Solid, man. On to my second account now. We have got my icon player pick, and then I've got a store pack to open this account as well. All right. Icon player pick first. Hey, we'll take Robbie C. That is a W, man. We'll take Robbie C. That is solid. He is worth still, like, 900k. He's probably one of the best left backs in the game. I think we're getting an Icon Evo soon. I don't know if he fits in the Icon Evo or not. I've really not looked into it too much. But, like, imagine him at evo Now, that would be very nice. But Robbie C is a good Icon to get. All right. Store pack time. We've got 2,000 FC points for the premium versus pack. It is tradable. This account could definitely do with some coins and informs, please, EA. No Ice or Fire card. But we have got ourselves a Jamal Muziala or a Maggle, actually. It could be a Maggle. Probably is a Maggle, isn't it? It is a Maggle. A Maggle and Bernardo Silva. So they'll go straight to the transfer list, I reckon, and just sell them. We do get two informs, though, which is nice. Mike Mignon, Megan Rapinoe, whatever. Uh, what do we have in the dupes as well? As it is tradable, so the dupes are all tradable too. We have ourselves in the duplicates. Tony Kroos, Parejo, Little. We have yeah, walkouts. You know what? That's not bad. We'll take that. That's a nice little juicer. All right, next icon pick. Let's get more wins, EA. These have been very good tonight. Another Butcher. We'll take that. When I saw Rivaldo, I didn't look at who it was. I just saw the left wing. And I saw, like, whenever I see left wing, I look straight down. And I see Brazil. And I'm like, oh, my God, it's Dino. Then I realize it's not Dino. Uh, Butcher is good, though. Butcher is good. We'll take that. And the, the answer to that question is, I'm not, his, I'm not his secretary. I don't know. Do I spec an icon? Look at that. Frank Lampard. I mean, it's not a very good icon, but like from a store pack, from a, sorry, from a like lightning round or whatever, that's the first time I packed an icon from a non-guaranteed icon pack in ages, it feels like. It's not worth a whole lot, but we'll take it. Let's go. Three eighty-five plus player picks coming right up. We are searching for the boy himself, Neymar. I'd take a young man son as well. I think there were some mini release players. I don't even know. I haven't really been keeping that much up with this promo. I think it's just a filler promo between now and team of the year. So I don't care too much about the promo, but hey, I would happily take a Neymar. A Neymar would be class. He'd stay in the club for a very long time. Third and final pick, though. The fodder's okay. I'm actually going to take Bernardo Silva, so I could just store them all in the club. The fodder's okay. It's just not insane, and we have a perfect link. Now it's time for some store packs. I'm going to open up the Ultra versus Pack. Guarantees a base icon and 11. Is it 11 or 14? 88 pluses? I don't even know. Who is going to be my icon? We've got Kevin De Bruyne as our uh, cheeky little walkout. All right, here we go. Come on. Come on. Be a good icon, EA. Please, man. Rudy! Let's go. I'm actually happy with that. I'll take a first own Wayne Rudy. Uh, United fan. Honestly, Wayne Rooney, one of my favorite players ever. Definitely my favorite player growing up. One of the most underrated players in Premier League history, in my opinion. Like, one of the greats. That pack is definitely not one of the greats. But Rooney 100% was. Absolute legend. So we'll take it. I'm going to open up the Elite Versus pack as well. I'm not going to lie to you. I actually think this pack's terrible. I, I like Of all the store packs, this might be one of the worst ones. It just You just end up with a club clogged with just rubbish. Like I just don't think it's worth it. But that being said, we do have ourselves a Marc-Andre to Stegen. And a double walkout behind him of Kylian Mbappe. Calling it right now. That's a... Funny looking killing Mbappe. Uh, we have Rodri. Fair enough. Um, let's see what else is in there. Don't open the pack then. Content, right? I, I, I'm going to hide behind content to be a DJ and Hradetsky again, man. Hradetsky and Marco Asensio. Oh, I pack these guys daily. Well, that wasn't worth it. I'm going to open up this 1k pack as well. I just can't leave it there by itself. I feel bad. What we got? We got ourselves Portugal. Centre back. 
Cavendish. Eh, 89 rated. What else is in there? Who's the dangler? Rodri. I'm getting sick of all these Man City cards, man. Every pack, I feel like it's got Man City cards in. Yeah, whatever the high rated. Shut your mouth, all right? It's annoying. What else we got in there? We got, ooh, a couple of informs. Bear and Castellanos. We'll take a little bit of Tati Castellanos. Ah, Marata. I just got rid of you, man. I just put you in SBC. Is Radetzky in there as well? No, he's not. I'm surprised. I just put Maratta in SBC, man. I don't want to get him back again. Three more 85 pluses as they re-upped. Let's see what we get. No fire ice card. I'm just going to take... I know I should take the 89, but I just can't be bothered. I don't have an SBC to put him into right now. I'm just going to take the non-duplicate versions. We still have no versus card. It's painful taking an 86 over an 89, but I can't be bothered. I'm being lazy. I know I'm being lazy. Ooh, okay. We'll take Edison. Fair enough. There we go. Um... Yeah, fair enough. I mean, it's not great, is it? Considering the only content EA have been dropping in the last couple of days are these 85 plus player picks. Here's three more of them. Let's see what we get in these three. Rodri, I'm going to take this time and just hold on to the fodder because there's actually literally nothing else to do. All right, second one. 86 Chiarelli. So I feel like I never pack. Like, she feels really rare for some reason. I had a final one now. What are we saying? In form, Frankie De Jong. Not bad. It's actually really not bad at all. Um, I didn't do Frankie De Jong's SBC either. So it's actually a card that it, I might use considering I've got a heavy Barcelona influence in my team. That's not bad. All right, Lala's 385 plus picks now. What's he saying? Ooh, 89 Alex Morgan. Not bad, not bad. Next one. That one's not great. We want high rated fodder really. Or special cards. Ooh, we got ourselves a cheeky Ice Morata. That is ice cold right there. 